this here. Oh no! Oh, damn! What the fuck? We gotta get up there. Wait, we have to decompress. What? My brother's up there. Damn it! Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah okay. Let's let's do it because right. we'll get the bends, as they call it. Let's go now. Go now, then. You've you've done it now, surely. This is taking too long. Oh, fuck! I'm going now. I have no idea what what that means. Bearing. What does bearing mean? Hey, what the hell is going on? Uh. Hey, JJ, don't worry about it. I mean, there was a really great explosion. Oh, it was the barbecue. Was it a barbecue? There was a little, uh, mishap with the barbecue. Jesus, oh, no. looks like the whole boat was lit up. She's going to get all, like, messed up now. What's up with the other boat? What's up with that other boat? These fishing guys came by and ran into the dive line. Whatever. Who cares, right? What I want to know is... What'd you guys find? Well, we found the plane, and it is huge, full of cool stuff. Oh my god, you guys, can you all just shut up for like one second? Oh god, it's all about you, Shit. Julia. Dude, Jesus. Bro, Nicely done. Come up and let's celebrate. All right, Fliss, you got happy. Oh, Christ, what happened? Conrad has schmoo schmoozed her. Schmooze, what a schmoozer. Oh, look, it's him again. What the fuck are you laughing at? You're getting to know these intrepid adventurers then. Alex and his yes. little brother Brad, trying to swim with the big fish. Both seem out of their depth. And Julia, the love of Alex's life. And he, the love of hers. What about Conrad? Married. A bold fellow, you might say. Or maybe you'd say arrogant. Oh, and then God. there's Captain Fliss. Strong, forthright, and a pain stubborn. in the ass. She appears somewhat immune to Conrad's charms, so far at least. <laughs> Let me reassure you. Secret. You help them to make some feature. decisions they'll value later on, and some I think they may regret. <laughs> I'm enjoying this. I like that guy as well. He's cool. I mean, he's, he's probably a bad guy. But, you know. So, we're like 10 seconds out of the jaws of certain death. Well, certain, I mean, that's relative. And this meatball... Meatball? This meatball pulls a meatball. ring out of God knows where. Yeah, where did you hide the ring? A lady never tells. Well, Up his asshole! Say, Sorry. Sorry. You know, it just, like, comes out. Don't play there, man, though. No? Wasn't Comrade gonna get us some more beers after he helped Fliss? Maybe he decided, hey, I'll drink some, and then he got drunk. And since he was drunk, he forgot to bring it to us. And he just kept on drinking, and he drank all of it. Uh, sounds like you've had some experience with this kind of phenomenon. Yeah, wow. I've been studying it for years. I'll go look for him. Conrad. Oh, I found a bullet Conrad. lodged in the plane. Huh. I left it below deck if you want to check it out. I'm going to play as Brad now. So, how does it feel to soon be known as the Mrs. Julia Smith? Um... I'll stick with my own name. Honestly, I wasn't sure how it would feel, but now that I hear it, it does have a nice ring. So, I guess we should talk about wedding plans. Eventually. That ear stud, though. Hmm. Let's plan it together. Dad can foot the bill. Now Let's you're speaking my language. I'm taking lessons. Yeah, I can't wait for us to plan everything together. Oh, the perfect so wedding. Weird, you might say no. Is that what the game's going to become? Is it just like a wedding uh, planning simulator? I'd, I'd love it. I'd, I'd actually love it. Of course. Of course I was going to say yes, you dimwit. I'm happy you did. The second you said yes, I could see our whole future rolling out ahead of us. Uh. All right, mate. Chill out. Let's make it really soppy. Yeah. Let's go. I love you. <laughs> All right, chill out. Where did everyone go? There is much celebration to be had. All right. I'll go find them. You just relax. Bearing updated. What does this mean, though? Is this just like events? Like, the like you know, significant events? Oh, whatever. We'll find out. Hey, you seen my brother? Or Fliss? 
Uh, no, I uh, got distracted. Let's go get him. Sure. Let's go get him. So, I'm really enjoying this so is, far. Uh, you know, where the magic happens. Oh. Give it a rest. Apologize for my brother. On behalf of my family, I'd like to apologize for my brother acting like a horny fifth grader. Ah, it's <laughs> okay. I can deal with children. Conrad, beers, where are they? Oh, yeah, the beers. I was just getting them now. I think Conrad's slowly becoming my favorite. Because he's kind of a bit of a douche. He's a bit of a douchebag. Oh, how All romantic. Right. Now that everybody's here, let's take a look at the navigator's pad we found. Maybe we can figure out why the plane was out here. Where'd you put it? It's in your case. Okay, I'll go get it. Hey. Now we're gonna find our way to the boat. The boat of death. And then all die on the boat so, of death. Let's go on. <clears throat> oh. The thing we found. Come here, you vixen. Oh god, get a room. Easy, get tiger. Room, guys. We should get back. Jesus. Right here. I mean, this is a relatively slow start to the game. I mean, it began with a bit of a, a fright. Hey, well, there's but sailor. I like it. Um, it's, it's, it's building tension. Careful. It's, it's nice if bit you of a did decompress too fast, then you should go easy on the beer. Uh, Alex, I'm fine. I think if I got the bends, I would know by now. Not always. Sometimes the bends can be super delayed. I mean, it could be hours or a day or two. I'm going to get the, the bends, bends, aren't I? Yeah, it's uh, when you come up from a dive too fast. Oh, 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 yeah, uh, uh, decompression sickness. <laughs> Nerd. <laughs> no nitrogen bubbles that get stuck in your bloodstream. Hurts like a bitch. It's really serious. I always get sick and die from Nerd. decompression sickness every year. And love that it. is why, That's why I love him. Conrad says drink him if you got him, because either you're fine or you're going to want a little something <laughs> to eat. Julia, Sorry. I'm telling you not to drink any alcohol right now. Oh, come on. Telling you, take orders from this guy. Just drink a beer. Relaxed beer o'clock. Um, yeah. Uh, maybe I'll stick to H yeah. two O. I don't think. Want to push my luck. Yeah. All right, everyone, check it out. I came up too early. I, I can't. Sure, gold. Yeah. Who wants to find some sunken treasure? I want to keep her alive. So She'll probably think, die Adam? of just. She probably the head will explode or something. Those are coordinates, all right. Maybe the plane's destination. You think we could get there by tomorrow? It takes a couple hours if the weather stays steady. Wow. You find anything else? There was a flight plan on board that seemed to indicate it was a rescue plane. Yeah, that makes sense. After the war, mm. they turned long-range bombers mm. into rescue planes. Mm. And then this plane must have been shot down because it was riddled with bullet holes. I found one lodged in the fuselage. Huh. And it was full of life rafts. Must have gotten shot down before they could deliver all the rafts. There was only one missing. Reckless. All of you. Excuse me? <gasps> I told you to leave oh, everything down there alone. Oh, come on. We've been through this already. I'm not talking about the law. No, hey. They were respectful. No, you did whatever you wanted. Whatever you took, it was too much. Oh, my God. Shut up. Oh, shut up, Fliss. On. Just shut up, No one knows up, we've Fliss. even been down there. And I don't think ghosts can talk. You Americans are all the same, huh? No respect for anyone else's traditions. You should have never gone down to that plane in the first place. It's bad luck. You think you can scavenge down there and it makes no difference, but She's every so single angry. thing you bring back has an essence. It's like a ghost you invite to the surface. Here we go. Huh. I never thought about it like that. You never think about much of anything. Well, maybe I never heard about such cool ghost stories. They're not cool <laughs> ghost stories. Not like for fun. People drown in these waters and you have to respect their resting place. Damn straight. Fred, you got a fun ghost story, right? <laughs> yeah, I heard a story. It happened right around here, too. Let's hear it. We could all use Gosh. a good show. Um. Yeah, let's, let's hear, it. hear it. I bet you can spin a good yarn. It's kind of messed up, actually. Go for it. I like messed up. Scare away, little bro. Okay, here goes. Don't scare me. This though. story is true. It had happened right near here, in an old lighthouse. Classic setup. Wait, <laughs> true story? Where'd you hear this? If you need to know, it's ripped right from the rotting pages of the terrifying ancient in-flight magazine I was perusing on our way here. The lighthouse stood atop an atoll, isolated from the rest of the world, a lone beacon in the night, 
a sailor's respite. The lighthouse keeper would hear the waves pounding the rocky shore. One misty morning, he comes upon a woman covered in blood. She's stumbling down the beach. He hurries to her aid, and she falls into his arms, sobbing. As he hurries her back to the lighthouse, he asks where she's from. He doesn't waste any time. Smooth. <laughs> Fuck it up. I love him so much. He of the one-track mind. The woman answers. I live here, in the lighthouse. My parents are upstairs right now. Twist. Mm -hmm. Of course, the lighthouse keeper says, that isn't so. Of course, he's lived there alone for years. And the woman becomes hysterical, and his sister parents are upstairs. So, they go to the top of the lighthouse, and there, splayed out on the floor, is a man and a woman brutally murdered with an axe. Always an axe. Whoa. I mean, do people even use axes Always anymore? an axe. Just Always an axe. Don't you know? Chase and all. Chopped up into little tiny giblets. With an axe. Ha! <laughs> giblets. Great word. That's gross. So gross. Okay, so who did it? So the woman, uh, she's still hysterical, says her husband did it. And he's still here. In the closet. Ha! <laughs> the husband, eh? <laughs> So is this a warning to all future brides? Hey, no backseas. You're locked in. So the lighthouse now you die with an axe. over to the closet, opens the door, and <coughs> sure enough, there's a man inside. <coughs> but he's cut his own throat. <sighs> Horrified, he looks closer to see the dead man's face in the dark. Closer. Closer. And he sees it's his own face. Whoa. And its eyes bulge out and screams. <laughs> oh, fuck! <laughs> yeah, he's so ah, gross. Hey, well, super twist. Nice. <laughs> nice one, Squire. You're a bastard, Brad. You really, you really, you really are. Cool story, bro. You have Damn it. Going. Pretty cool. Yeah, That's like, what, four, there, five, dog. six jump scares? All okay. had me. They've all had me. All had your fun. We should all turn in. There's someone. What's the relationship? Alex is great, Conrad, yeah, Brad, Fliss, nobody likes Fliss, you bitch. Uh -uh. No, 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 because according to standard vessel regulation, we're all required. One more beer before hitting the hay. What regulations are these? Hey, it's cool guy regulations. Conrad regulations. Institutional protocol, subdivision 1099. Uh-huh. <laughs> Where'd you read that? The internet. Oh, so you found a website that tells you to drink beer under every circumstance. I'm just <laughs> following orders, ma'am. <laughs> I'm into this website. <laughs> Ten four, good buddy. And I'm out. Nice cheap little jump scare right at the end there, you know, just to keep me off my toes. Thanks. Thanks for that. Oh shit. Everyone's asleep. Oh, this is it. Tension builds now. If people are going to come back at the boat. I'm going to call it now. Oh, they're there, yeah. Yo. Oh. So bad with pressing buttons. Oh no! Oh no! Oh god! Is someone gonna die already? Shit on it! <gasps> oh god no! Oh, I'm gonna kill someone. Right, concentrate. Crazy eye, crazy eye guy. Poke him in the crazy eye. No, poke him in the good eye. Poke him in the good eye. Oh shit, oh shit. Who do I ungag? Ah, uh, you. Hmm. I just ungag both of them. 
Boom. <sighs> Fuck, all this bloody escalated quickly, didn't it? Ungag Fliss, come on, we can't be a bastard about this, can we? Go! <laughs> right, they're doing everyone. Okay, okay. Shit. Why are they. Why, why has this happened? Why are they doing this? I think so. You coming back? That's the guy hit on the head. Hey. Oh no, hey. they're all pissed hey. off. Stop it. Oh no. Oh, you can kill that, okay. Oh, almost free. Like, they're freakishly calm about this. Like, I'd be screaming. Like, I'm less calm than they are. Hey, so, uh, good news, bad news. Bad news? I don't see how this could get any worse. The bad news is these are kind of maybe the fishermen I pissed off earlier. Oh, God damn it, Conrad. Great. They it's absolutely great. are. And the good news? Uh, I recognize them. How is that good news? I thought you were going to ask the good news first. You're such an idiot. <laughs> Jesus. Hey. Oh, Conrad. Alex, what are they going to do to us? I don't even want to know. Look at that beautiful depth of field graphics. Oh, oh. Here. Sorry. I'm a lot of danger. Um, untie. Investigate. Investigate. <sighs> Alexa, stop. Sorry for anyone with an Alexa. I'm really sorry. You're gonna regret this, you piece of shit. You're gonna run in a cell. Yeah, you tell him, girl. You tell him. Oh, God. Oh, he's back. Oh, oh I mean, he missed, mate. He missed. Ah, fuck out. Ah, I'll be back for you later. I'll be back. <laughs> no, what are they doing? Oh, Nobody God. knows you're out here, little lady. You're all alone with us now. Let's make the most of it. You can go fuck yourself, you piece of shit. You're the little lady. Now's not the time, Conrad. Oh, right in the dick. Oh, no, the bed. Never mind. <laughs> oh, sh! Get out. Oh, no, what's gonna happen? ASDW. Uh, I know how to cheat, yeah. Let's be serious, just for a second. What do you fuckers want? What's he doing? What's he got? A knife. Oh god. Slow down. Easy. I don't, I feel like if I agitated him, like, he would have stabbed me in the neck. But now I feel like a bit of a pussy for saying that. Be on your best behavior, little man. Get off! Get off of me! Yeah, let's redeem himself. Ooh! Oh, they have a comrade. like you're still tied up. Like, I, I, I'm, I'm, like, too tense to talk. Like, I didn't even know what's happening. Like, oh my god! Oh, Jesus, Conrad. Yeah. Wait, wait, no! Alex! Oh, no! Why are they doing this? Like, you just take one, one person out. Hey. 
Lipstick. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> I don't think they're gonna hit her. Fair point. They haven't hit Fliss. Fliss sure seems to be getting buddy buddy with him. Yeah, she is. Bitch. Is he yeah, he's hiding. He's okay. All right. Turn around. Don't let them see your hands. Once we get Julia back, <coughs> we can take them by surprise. Okay, they're coming. <gasps> What was the point in that? What are they, what are they doing? Motherfuckers! Hey! Hey! Are you okay? What did they do to you? I'm fine. They didn't touch me. They asked about our parents. What? How much money they have. Alex, oh. I'm so sorry. What? What is it? They took my ring. Julia, it's okay. It's okay. Shit! What a bastard! She have told me they were getting married. Maybe they, were, you know, we could have invited them. Now we just have to wait and see what they want to do with us. Mutilate your bodies and eat your eyes out. Ha! I have no idea. Maybe we can take it. Yeah. Yeah, it's a speedboat. The main guy here. He's got a gun. Well, at least one of us can get on their boat. He does have a it's gun. Out. I know that because the picture told me. If you can distract him. Yeah. I can get on that boat. We can get on the boat, Conrad. Get on the boat, Conrad. Until I'm long gone. Right, seven seconds. I can get out through the window. We gotta break these off first. Too loud. They'll hear it. But we're gonna break them uh, down to thunder. Good call. I'll go through the window and get the boat. You guys. I'm gonna have to time this now. Conrad, oh shit, I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do it. And get to the boat. I'm gonna have to time this okay, now. Let's do it. Responsibility's on me. <laughs> Was I supposed to like? Ugh, it. Oh, stay calm. Okay. Oh shit. Stay calm. Go fuck yourself. Connie, now! I did it. Oh god. What should I do? What do I do? Escape. Grab the. Grab the knife. Oh, I didn't grab the knife. Oh, shit. I pressed the wrong button again. What's wrong with me? Oh, Conrad's dead. You're pretty stupid. Oh, no, not my favorite person. Conrad! Oh, no. Bring them downstairs. Dig this. Use it if you have to. Oh, my God, I really fucked that up. Oh, God. What is wrong with me? Sit down. Over there. You, right here. Right, ASDW. ASDW. No. Arrêtez, bande de con. C'est mon bateau. Stop! Ferme-la, ou je te mets mon poing dans la gueule. Shit. Come here. They found the thing. The, the thing. The important thing. You know. The thing. Which one of you is gonna tell me about this? 
Manchurian goo. What? What? Fuck! animations though. Hey, all right. You gave it your best shot. All right. Shut the fuck up. Ooh. There is no harm in just talking. You want to talk? Keep the volume down. I'm just gonna Thanks, say, buddy. Flitz has got to be in on this. She these guys. They travel in the same waters. She's the captain and they barely laid a hand on her? I bet you told them about the Manchurian goal. They're in cahoots. They're in cahoots. How oh, dare you. It isn't true. Are you out of your mind? Uh-oh. How did you come up with this bullshit? How fucking dare you, you overprivileged asshole? You're all in this together. This is a trap. And you set us yeah, up! Yeah, so. Put a cork in it! <laughs> Put a cork in it! Ah! Oh, I pressed the right one! <laughs> Sit still! All of you! Yay! You! Come with me! God, like, I'm trying to memorize the buttons in my head right now. I'm not, like, I'm not even concentrating. Jesus! Come on! Find out how long the storm is she in on them? You try anything, anything fishy, and there'll be consequences. Get it? Okay. Duke of Milan requesting weather update. Over. Duke, we read you. Everything okay? Over. Ask for help. How bad's the storm? Hey, uh, just requesting any information about this storm you can give us. It's a little bit hairy out here. Over. Big storm coming in from the east. Gonna hit you pretty Is there any way I can, like, say something to make him think that I'm in trouble? Sound a little stressed, Duke. Let me know if you need assistance. Not used to a little weather freaking you out. Oh, what do I do? <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. A okay out here. We can handle a couple of buffs and drops of rain. Uh, thanks for the info. We'll see you for drinks back on shore in a couple of days. Would he have got a hint from that? Would he be like, oh, go find out anyway? Because you seem a bit stressed. Oh, oh, oh I pressed the fucking wrong one again! God, I need to really need to fit, like, concentrate. Shit! Do you get that? Don't you? something to happen like at any time and I really don't know good job I'm pretty not good at these one. buttons real smooth great leadership Fliss anyone know about Brad is he hiding somewhere <gasps> shut up Brad is under the bunk bed shut up my drone oh god he could help he could help <laughs> keep a lid on it it could be our ticket out Brad stays hidden. Better off down there than with these psychos. Oh yeah, great. He could get killed down there. Brad's a big boy. He'll be okay. And it's probably better for us if he stays put. For he now. won't be okay. Oh, it's 
gosh. Ah! Nah, that didn't get me. That didn't get me. <laughs> I'm getting good with this. Alive. Things could have been quite different. Really? I felt like I, like, I, I, I messed up everything. How is everyone still alive? And you also seem disappointed with that as well, buddy. Kind-hearted creature I am, I'd like to offer you some forewarning of what's to come. Tempted? Yes. Curious. Yes, absolutely. <laughs> Give me hints. <laughs> okay, we will turn to the Bard for inspiration. The Merchant of Venice, Act 2, Scene 7. The Prince of Morocco pulls a scroll from the eye of a skull and reads, All that glisters is not gold. Often have you heard that told. Anyway, now that you've reached a point of significant distress, I presume you're yes. eager to get back to your story. But here's a thing. Mm. Everything may not be entirely as it seems. Oh, you're an alcoholic. <sighs> Probably shouldn't have said that. Not everything is as it seems. Oh, God, here we go now. Well, what a bloody ride. I think I'm going to leave it there for now, folks. Um, I hope you've enjoyed so far. I certainly have. I don't usually play these kind of games, so, you know, which is why I'm so bad. I mean, I'm not making excuses for why I'm bad. I just am bad. I'm sorry. But I'm loving it. It's scary, but not too scary, <laughs> so I can actually play it. So if you've enjoyed this, then like it, comment down below, share the video, and if you think you want to watch more of this with me, then subscribe and hit the not notification bell. And if you're watching any other sort of small YouTubers out there, give them a little bit of help and subscribe to them too.